Arvinge, Arvin Wright, Arvinge writes, um, Norton blocking Wi-Fi. Recently installed Norton. I trusted the Wi-Fi in the settings and it worked fine. Next day, the Wi-Fi is still trusted, but when I attempt to connect, it says no internet secured in Windows settings. Um, I trusted the Wi-Fi in the, in the settings and it worked. Next day, the Wi-Fi is still trusted, but whenever I attempt to connect, it says no internet secured. Um, Norton has been a joke in horror story. Try removing Norton and see if that fixes the problem. Okay, well. Um, no internet secure. Okay, well, if it is a legit copy of Norton, what happens when you disable it? Does the internet immediately work? What happens if you try to migrate to a different website? Does the internet work? Let me know, thanks. Yeah, so we'll just go with that, like this on this one. There's a reason for that. Uh, we don't wanna go too far, but also we really just kinda wanna know what happens when Norton is disabled before we continue on. Sure, I, I would also accept going to command prompt, doing an IP config space all to make sure that your DNS is there. Um, Cause it sounds like you may not have a DNS or maybe it's blocking the DNS, but uh, we would know more if we actually typed in icon, IP config space forward slash all and see if this DNS is actually still there. But there's no point in going that way. If we can just disable Norton and see if that fixes this issue. If it does, then, then we know where the problem is and we just have to turn off a particular setting, especially if he wants to keep Norton. Okay, Arvinge, we'll just go that route. So keep us posted there, all right?